So I'm trying to do this whole reel a day thing and I get so caught up in the comparison trap, like wanting to make my reels be something uh, marketable, something that competes with other comedians, other entertainers, and I don't fucking want to do that. So I'm just going to kind of do my own thing just because at the end of the day, this is just, it's, I'm doing this because I want to create a community of like-minded people who want to leave the world more equitable than they found it. Um, anyway, so yeah, doing these videos, I'm just trying to game the algorithm, and really the only people watching it are people who support me, so thank you. Thank you for supporting me and being a part of this journey. Um, I have a lot of creative ideas coming up. Uh, I've uh, been really thinking about the future a lot lately, and um, I guess I will take this time to set my intentions and announce my goals of putting together a uh, Fringe show for uh, next year's Cincinnati Fringe. Um, I, I love the Fringe Festival, it, uh, the the it's what brought me back to the theater. Uh, I was doing just schmucky theme park stuff. I say schmucky. It was so much fun. I never speak ill of my time with the Halloween Horror Nights team, but it really inspired me to, to go back to my roots, and I just, I've always loved telling a story with a bunch of my friends. That's what theater is to me. Telling my friends stories and doing it with my friends. Doing it with my family, really. Um, some the only the spaces I always felt most accepted in were theater spaces. Um, it was the one place where it felt like I didn't have to like fit an identity because I could just be different identities. Um, I've always loved being a clown. That was something I did a lot in theater to play Pan once in a very shallow production of Midsummer Night's Dream. I say shallow, it was so much fun. It was a theater camp, um, and I've always wanted to be a Shakespeare fan, but I do not have the auditory processing capabilities to keep up with Shakespeare. I'm sure if I trained, if I learned the language of Shakespeare, um, I would appreciate it more. But it is, it, is, it is German opera to me. I do enjoy going to it, much like German opera. Um, but I don't think I could uh, tell you what the fuck my purpose was. I could then. I understood it back then. Um, and as I understand it now, Puck. Oh, I've been saying Pan. It's Puck. <gasps> oh, I'm terrible. See, this is why I'm not allowed in Shakespeare spaces. Um, anywho. Just the... Getting to play an element of chaos was so much fun. I really enjoyed uh, being a goofball. Where was I going with this? Oh, just theater. Theater's great. Theater's important. I'm a fucking clown. And that's my purpose in life. And it feels good to have a purpose. And to know that purpose. Uh, I think one of the leading causes of suffering is a purposeless life. And fun fact, nothing is real, none of this matters, so you get to pick your purpose. Um, and I have decided that my purpose is to bring people together for their purpose. Anyway, thanks for, um, if you stuck to the end, appreciate you. Uh, I'm going to be doing more, like, super low effort content like this because, uh, right yeah, that's my light. Uh, my time's up. You guys, love you all so much. Thanks, bye.